you know the drill, sneezing, sniffling, coughing, maybe itchy nose. More than 50 million Americans experience allergies. And if you feel like it's lingering a little longer or coming a little earlier, it's true. When spring arrives early, pollen comes with it. Combine that with coronavirus and a shift to more indoor living and your allergies might be getting the best of you. An earlier spring season, dramatic changes in the weather and spending more time outdoors. A lot of people are more indoors now because of COVID and that would be uh, more dust and mold and perhaps domesticated animals. It all adds up to one thing. Having itchy eyes and not being able to stop like the teary eyed while um, I'm outside. Sneeze attacks. They, it can cause migraines and you know sinus infections. And, and while cleaning is at an all time high, some chemicals in the products can actually make your allergies worse. The best thing to do is to try to be uh, as least inflamed as you can by avoiding triggers. For pollen, avoid the outdoors at its peak and keep doors and windows closed. After being outside, take a hot shower and change into some clean new clothes. Air out your clothes in a dryer instead of sun drying. Always take your shoes off at the door and recirculate the air in your house and car. For dust, wash your bedding in hot water at least once a week. And for mold, reduce moisture in your bathroom and kitchen by using a HEPA air filter. Doctors also recommend talking with an allergist or your pharmacist, because I love them, about the over-the-counter medications that you can take, like antihistamines and topical nasal steroid sprays. But they should be taken just for a short term. Keep that in mind.